What's cooking everybody? It's Dor, and in today's video I'm going to show you how to get not one, but two starships in No Man's Sky. They're both chrome needle nose fighters and feature Mega 7 wings. The difference lies in the accent color and thrusters. The red one has a triple thruster and the yellow one a box thruster. And so without any further ado, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do is to make sure that multiplayer is turned off in the network settings. Then you have to go to a portal in the Euclid Galaxy and enter the following glyphs. The face. The sunset. The tree. The bird. Another sunset. And another bird. Two times the atlas the Diplo, and finally, three times the sunset. Go through the portal and you should arrive on Bros 3 in the Kuyaman Odex system. Get into your ship and fly towards the trade station. Should you not know how to locate one, or be interested in the ship I'm currently flying, I will leave a link on both in the description down below. I also want to ask you to please leave a like and or a comment if you found this video helpful in any way, and don't forget to subscribe to be informed on all things No Man's Sky, from beginner's guides to amazing starships and anything in between. When you've landed on a trade station, all you have to do is get out of your starship to create an autosave and reload it, as this will make sure that the spawns will reset. When you've loaded back into the game, you want to find a place where you have a good overview of the incoming ships and wait for the ship to arrive. While we're waiting, I want to thank Skizx13 for posting this to the No Man's Sky Coerence Exchange subreddit. I noticed that both ships usually come in early in the wave, so wait a few minutes before reloading your save to try again. But there's the red one. Just approach the pilot to be able to claim it. As you see I've settled on an A-Class here, but as it is a rich system you could try to reload for an S-Class or of course upgrade it using nanites. If you prefer the yellow one instead, just use the same method as I've just shown you. So I hope you enjoyed the video and these very cool almost identical fighters in No Man's Sky and I'll hopefully see you in the next one. Thank you so much for making it this far into the video. If you liked it, make sure to leave a thumbs up and let me know in the comments down below. If you really did, please subscribe and if not, well, I hope I get to convince you in the next video.